All right, you guys, there it is. In this video, I'm going to show you how to do this right here. This is a single tree hook. Well, guys, when you're forging at your forge and you're wanting to learn, especially you beginners who want to learn how to forge weld, always weld something when you got your forge started up. And uh, sooner or later, you guys, you'll get it right, you'll do it right, and, you, and you'll be uh, tickled with yourself. Hey you guys, God bless you and welcome back to my forge. In this video guys, I'm going to show you how to make a hook just like this right here that goes on a single tree. I know everybody knows what a single tree is. I modified this one you guys years ago to hang deer and hogs on. So that's what I used to do with that one right there. It used to be about this much longer on each end. Today I'm going to show you how to forge the top hook that you see right there in my hand. That one that's hanging down there. So that's what we're going to do. Now the single tree there for you people who don't know what it is, that's the go between horses bridles and all kind of gear on your horse to you pull a wagon or whatever you're doing. So I'm going to fire the forge up and get it really hot and I'll show you how to do it. Guys. I'm going to use the same technique I did for that jump weld. I'm going to take a piece of cold metal the same size as we're going to make this out of. Then, we'll forge it right down over that until we've got the Nice little dent in it right there. Hope you guys can see that. See that little dent right there in that piece of metal? That eye right there in the top, guys, is three quarters of an inch. So I'm going to start it over here on the horn of the anvil, take it over there and put it in the vise, and turn it around a piece of three quarter inch metal. See how that's shaped right there? Just bring that back over this way, you guys. We're going to heat it up, we're going to flux it, and we're going to forge weld it right there. Guys, there's the initial weld. Guys, I hope that bright sun ain't making it too hard for you guys to see that right there.
that's a single tree hook you guys and these can be made in various sizes depending on what you're going to use them for. That's how they hook right there. Now I need to forge this piece but I'll do that in a later video. Guys, I hope you're enjoying these blacksmithing videos. I enjoy doing them and uh, teaching what I know. So thanks for watching, and once again, God bless you. Have, a, have yourself a great day.